Mike Vick with the pleasure of being joined by famous Jameis. They call him Jay Boo, <laughs> quarterback of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and recently paired with new head coach Bruce Arians. Jay Boo, thanks for joining me today, man. Oh, the pleasure's mine, man. I'm in your city, baby. Yes, absolutely. Atlanta is my city, and you are more than welcome to be here. Let's get into it about your new head coach. You got to be excited about that. Um, Bruce is a mastermind, certainly a guy who's going to take your game from one level to the next. How do you feel about that as far as right now? What you feeling? I'm very excited about that. Uh, the mentality that he has, uh, his resume says speaks for itself. Absolutely. So I'm just happy to, to link up with him and, and do some big things. Especially at an important time in your career, you have to be excited about you know being paired with a guy who's going to know how to put you in the best positions. As far as the weapons, what, what do you think you need to add to this team um, in order to you know, be able to compete each and every week on Sundays and get the most out of your offense. I think we got one of the most talented skill groups in the league. Deshaun yeah. Jackson, Mike Evans, O.J. Howard, Cam Brake, on down. Even young Adam Humphreys, one of the best slots in the right. game. Right. You know, uh, I, I just think all we got to do is add consistency. Yeah. Uh, that's for me. That's from everybody. Just come yeah. out there and get some wins because winning rules. Yeah. I think as an offense, Having a stable backfield, stable running back is one of the key components to making the offense go. Is that something that you think y'all need to improve on as far as the run game and getting the run game going, which will allow you to become a better passer play action-wise? I think we got a good running back in Payne Barber. He's a he's a true three-down back for us. We got a young back, uh, yeah. Ronald Jones. He's stepping up last year, his first year. You know, he's just trying to get uh, acclimated to things. Right. But I think it will make our offense a little bit more explosive if we had that supposed to run game too. But I think we got some some good areas in the run game that we can build upon. Okay. And, uh, and really, it's really about dominating the line of scrimmage. Right. You know, our offensive line did a good job, so uh, we got to really open up everything. It's about dominating the line of scrimmage on both sides of the yeah. ball. You got two outstanding receivers in Deshaun Jackson and Mike Evans. Um, that That's a treat too. Now, I spoke to Deshaun recently, and he wanted me to talk to you about finding ways to get him more involved in the offense. What's your relationship like with Deshaun? I think it's one of the truest relationships that you can have. Yeah. You know, one thing Deshaun gonna do, he gonna keep it real with you. And I think as a quarterback, when you have a receiver like that, you respect that. Yeah. You know, when you know you got a playmaker like him, he wants the ball, he feeds off the ball. Right. So this is something that I gotta continue to work at, at, yes. at with him to get him the ball. Takes man. reps. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, you know, me and Mike. Uh, we have that relationship. We have that, you know, that one-two punch. Right. Me and Deshaun, we're going to develop that because, I mean, the man, he got skills out the yin-yang. I just got to give him the ball. Whether it's not just long down the field, yeah. it's just, short, just putting short the ball in his hands. Put the ball in his hand, let him do what he do because he's one of the greatest to ever play. Last question, Jameis. Your expectations for 2019. Come 2020, when you look back on the 2019 season, what do you want it to look like for you? Man, as in every year, you always have high expectations, man. But, you know, I ain't even talking about no records now. I'm just been about that action, man. Yeah. I got to bounce back strong. I got to hit them hard, man. Yep. And I, I can't leave these fools now to talk about. And, and and no pressure, but obviously playoffs has to be something that you, you, you have in your sights. It's necessary. It's necessary. Absolutely. Absolutely. And actions that can only speak, man. They don't even matter. And that's all that needs to be said. Jameis Winston putting the pressure on himself. To become the best, and that's what it takes to be the best. With Thank the you, goat James. Himself. Absolutely.